Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video, I'll be talking you through how to convert a wide panel to a long panel in Excel. So here we have a um, data set on the number of how to do travels in each of the states in the United States over a period of some years, 2012 to 2021. So this is, as it were, in the wild format, uh, the wide format of a panel, in, in a panel style. So I want to convert it to a long panel where I will just have a single column containing the variables over the several years across the several states. So uh, let's start by, so the first thing you need to do on your desktop is to uh, press and hold down alternate button D and the P button. So the alternate button, so you, you hold down the alternate D and P, you hold it down together. Um, that should bring up um, that should bring up the uh, the alternate D and B button should bring up the pivot table. The pivot table. Yeah, so that's it. the alternate D, or it's called Alt D P. So you have to press the three at the same time. Alt plus D plus P to pop up the pivot table as well as the pivot chart wizard. So here we have the next thing is um you see you have some buttons there. You click on the you check the multiple consolidation ranges. The multiple consolidation ranges, and then you go to next. And then you tell Excel that you would like to create uh, the page field. So you have, I will create the page field. Then you click on next. Then it brings up this range. What range are you looking for? Actually, you're looking for all the ranges. So uh, since if you know the what you just generally is to click on the first cell, in this case, geo name, and then um, Hold down your shift and your control button depending on how you do it and select all the years across the years and across the entire data. So you see it's just saying you are selecting all the data, you know, the, 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 the observations in the Excel sheet, that's what it basically means. And then if you once you've done this, then you go to next, and then you tell data that you don't want you want this report to be created in a new sorry, you, you tell Excel rather that you want this uh, report to be created in a new worksheet and that's what is already selected by default and then you click on finish what you get it's like it's similar it's as if nothing has happened because this is still in wide format okay but you go down to the very last observation which is this you can see my mouse over in there this one the last observation and you double click on that and immediately it transforms to the uh, the wild the wild uh, the, 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 the long panel, it changes the, um, so here you have the wide, if um, it brings up the, in the previous sheet, that sheet 5 for me, you have the wide panel and in sheet 6, which is the new uh, sheet created, you have the long panel, you can just put your, uh, your variable titles again, once again, and, and that's it for me, that's how to create, um, that's how to transform, panel data model, I mean panel data from wild format to long format. Thank you very much for listening and please subscribe to my channel if you've not done that and to receive more updates on simple econometric uh, statistical manipulations and how to use data. Uh, till we meet next time, take care of yourself. Bye.